Cover letters help to provide context and personal insight to employers in more detail than a resume. As a complement to your resume, cover letters provide additional explanation and are an opportunity to expand on more specific examples of your qualifications. Beyond these introductions and explanations, a cover letter is meant to motivate an employer to interview you and also illustrates your writing ability. Each cover letter should be personalized for each specific employer and position. By tailoring the document, you can demonstrate your knowledge of the employer and how your qualifications meet their specific needs. Keep in mind that sending a generic cover letter may be perceived as a lack of effort or interest in the company or as an indicator of poor quality work. Be sure to take the time to personalize each letter. Tailoring your cover letter requires doing some research. Look to the job description, a company's values or mission statement, or other information on their website as a guide for what they're looking for. With the company and position in mind, the cover letter will consist of four paragraphs. After including a proper heading and salutation, the content includes an introductory paragraph, two body paragraphs that tell your story and demonstrate your skills and experiences, and a concluding paragraph. This content should balance your interest in the position and company with a discussion of your qualifications. Each of these elements are discussed in detail in other videos. As you prepare and format a cover letter, remember that this is a professional document and should be one page in length. Use a professional and legible font size 10 to 12 point. Consider using the same font as your resume for consistency. Note that cover letters follow business writing conventions. As a result, text should be single space, paragraphs are not indented, and a space between paragraphs denotes a new paragraph. Given that cover letters are a demonstration of your writing and professionalism, they should be free from error. Be sure to give yourself plenty of time to research the organization and write your document. You might also consider reading your cover letter aloud or asking for help proofreading to catch any errors. Be sure your document is a professional and positive representation of you and your experiences. For more information or to have your document reviewed, visit us on the first floor of Crosby at Career and Professional Development.